am a third year still PhD student. I'm almost a fourth year PhD student. I study influence and how robots can influence people's behavior, especially for improving health and uh, building healthy habits. I work with the PR2, which is actually sitting right behind me. I've worked with Dragonbot. But what I really care about is actually supporting people's autonomy. I think robots can help make people feel like they're more in charge of their own lives who need a hand with things. So I'm really interested in understanding what kind of social behaviors can help foster people's autonomy while still helping them make the choices that they, that they want to make. So people who really want to make healthier decisions or who want to remember to take their medicines, how do you have a robot help them do that without them feel like the robot is micromanaging their lives? I personally didn't even realize that computer science was a possibility for me until I got to college, until actually after I took my first programming class where I figured, you know, oh, this will be useful for other things I want to do. And then I suddenly realized, this is really cool. I really like doing this. This is interesting. The problems are interesting. I like the, the problem solving aspect of it. I like the language aspect of it. Engineering can be great. Even undergraduate engineering degrees can be great. And yeah, maybe you pull some all-nighters, you work really hard at the end of the semester finishing up your projects, but it should feel worth it. And if that's not what you're feeling, then you should be talking to your advisor about what other classes can I take? What is it that you don't like about it? The odds are, if you're someone who likes math and science, who thought you really wanted to, to do engineering, it may not be engineering that you don't like. It may just be this particular engineering major isn't right for you. Look around you and see, think about what's gonna make you happy as an engineer and seek those things out. Your undergraduate life is part of your life. You should be happy then too.